my side returns. Your prince has accepted the gift I offered. He is a visionary. He sees beyond convention. But what about you? Do you still question the value of my blessing? He suffered enough in life. In death, I am giving him the glory he deserves. I told him by giving in to my guidance. Together we could purge this land of all our enemies. He was willing to make this sacrifice. You should honor his decision. I may not be a god, but with the strength of the prince's soul, my powers are considerable. Come, see for yourself. That certainly wasn't my finest hour, but I thought, I thought it was R.K. I thought he was giving me a second chance. There's nothing more foul than this creature's deception. It must have hailed from the depths of oblivion itself. Death. Death and destruction. It would have given me vengeance against my enemies, but it wouldn't have stopped there. It will never stop unless we stop it. Even now, I can sense the darkness inside, gaining strength again. Please, kill me. Yes, the life force inside me is evil through and through. Thank you for saving me, friend. I wish I could have known you when I was alive. But this will have to suffice. I am ready to die. Ready as I can be, I suppose. If you have said your goodbyes, Prince Adrian, it is time. Oh. Wait. Are you sure right, there's no Valeri. other way? I accept it. And you must too. You served me in life and saved me in death. Be at peace now. This chill. I remember it. Goodbye, Valeri. It is done. His body and soul are at rest. It's done then. He can now rest again. For good this time. I suppose I should be relieved. But somehow I feel like I've let him down. I did everything in my power to protect him. If I could have taken the death blow on the battlefield, I would have done it without hesitation. He should have been king. I'll return to Evermore to serve the crown. I am still a knight. It's my duty. First, though, I will do what I came here to do. I will lay the prince to rest. We should honor who the prince was in his life, not the abomination he became in death. I will leave you to your mourning. <laughs> 